Uh, rejected by every medical school in the country. Welcome to Med School in the Caribbean. Where's Goldman? Would you like some? No, thanks. I'm a cow man. USA Today says it looks and feels like nothing else on TV. Something just nibbled my leg. It has character. Going to Extremes premieres next Tuesday on ABC. What do you mean you're hitting the road? Your father could always come around. Yeah, when hell freezes over. Look, if he comes around, and we're not talking weeks or months here, Joe, we're talking decades, I don't plan on hiding out that long. When the AIDS Memorial Court comes to Landview, now Andrew is really going to be under the gun. Now, why don't you want to be there to support him? Oh, I'm looking real forward to seeing the quilt. A huge monument to homos just like me, all of whom have died. You sound just like your father. Yeah, well, you know, do you think, do you think those things he said to me all these years, they just bounce off? They don't. They sink in. Sometimes I think I hate myself almost as much as he hates me. He doesn't hate you. I'm leaving, Joey. I'm sorry. Asa? Blair, honey. You awake? Yeah, come, come on in. I was, uh, I was going downstairs for a nightcap. I couldn't sleep. I'm glad. I mean, I'm glad that you're awake. As tired as I was, I couldn't fall asleep either. How come? I kept thinking about your offer to help me start my jewelry company. Are you still going to give me your answer tomorrow? Tomorrow is now, isn't it? About an hour ago. Then here's my answer. Yes. Oh, Blair. That is music to my ears. Well, I can't think of anything I'd like more than to work with you and make this dream come true. It's funny. You see, I never thought you could be more beautiful than you are. But when you start thinking big, you, you light up like the hills of Texas at dawn. Well, it's a pretty intoxicating idea. I mean, thinking of glamorous women all over the world wearing jewelry that I've designed. There's something about your own beauty that shows up in those pieces that will even make ugly women blossom. Now, what we have to do, we've got to get the word out. Well, how do we do that? The bottom line, you've got to be more of a public figure. You've got to meet distributors, uh, press the flesh, do lunches. That's how you make contacts. Now, I can get you on a few committees and on a, on a few boards. As a matter of fact, I'm giving a very large donation to the children's charities of Landview. It's just, you know, it's just getting off the ground. You can be chairwoman. Well, that all sounds wonderful, Asa. Why do I think I hear a but? I just want to make sure that we're clear on, on one thing. Now, my company will not be a part of Buchanan Enterprises, right? I mean, it's mine. And only mine? Like I told you, honey. No strings attached. So let those sugar plum fairies uh, fly around your head. And if you start to feel sleepy, uh, join me. My bed is awful lonely without you, Blair. You're quite a woman. Buchanan. Goodbye, Max. something here? Well, I sure did. I, I vowed to the goddess that I would never, ever kiss your lips again. Not ever oh, again. Oh, well, wait, wait a minute. I think, I think this was her idea. I think no, she liked this. No, you might be too old to adopt our new tricks, but I'm not. I still can. I got a new trick. It works on the water, too. No, 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 Max. Okay, look, Mona. 
Look, I think I finally got things straight. Yeah, when you're high on hooch and when you're when you're mad at Blair. That's not how you really feel. Are you sure I'm not gonna feel this way when I'm sober? Ask me when you are. Sitting here in the dark. I was waiting for you. Well, I went to Wanda's and I had coffee with Renee. Hmm. You don't have to explain to me where you were. Don't I? Hmm. Well, have you uh, made your decision? Yes, I have. I'm sorry, I'm staying here. Thank you. 